Today we're going to check out two EDC flashlights from Amazon or you can get them on Amazon. They're both under $20 and uh, these are a special kind of usage. So they're not just the kind that you throw in your pocket. These are actually like for vest, vest pocket and collar clips. So what that means is that they are meant to be some sort of a hands-free pointed at whatever you're looking at type of thing. So the alternative to these are uh, your traditional headlamps um, that you strap around your head and those can get cumbersome they look stupid and you can't really wear them around all the time the reason that I discovered these is that I was actually using a headlamp because I started doing more work outdoors as you know we're not doing much stuff indoor anymore now both of these flashlights they share um, a few features that are very similar so both flashlights feature a clip on the back as well as an adjustable beam in the front so that's what these are see this one goes like so and then with this one you have more of a knob but you have full 180 adjustment on the night core the clip is I would say more of an everyday practical usage you can have this on your belt pull it out and it's just a matter of clipping it to your front pocket or clipping it to your collar and then they also have magnets right here so you can just stick them somewhere and then leave them hanging that's actually really useful it's see you know it's not as uh, tight as the coast so something like this this kind of clip is more for if you're wearing uniform or you really want this guy to stay on there the whole time so you, you would just stick it in and it's not moving anywhere you know there's no kind of adjustments or anything so you clip this on you push it once illuminates you can adjust it if you need to go higher or lower so red LED is for when you want to preserve your night vision. When you turn it off, you can still see in the dark. The Coast works a little bit different, so it's more of a traditional, you have three brightness settings, so brightest, medium, light, and then you have a flashing, and it'll turn off. And then for the red LED, it's a different button, and it's actually not very bright at all for the red. So I think this is more of like a signal for other people versus a light that you would use to illuminate. So as you can see, you can adjust the beam and it's really smooth it's actually it's almost a little too smooth because like it, it can get knocked you know this it's a little more stiff but you get a lot more purchase and it once you you know you don't have to worry about it being like knocked out of place they're both under twenty dollars so they're kind of like you know within the same um, range as you can see obviously the coast is a lot more compact I mean they're both very compact but the coast is like super compact it's thinner it's shorter it's lighter um, for EDC, you know, you might automatically think, okay, the thinner, smaller, lighter guy is the way to go. And maybe so if that's what you're looking for. Okay, so the whole time I was calling these two lights the wrong thing. So <laughs> this one on the left is the Coast, this one on the right is the Night Core. Okay, so the Coast comes with uh, two AAA batteries and the batteries are in this weather resistant door right here, right there. Now. That might be a turn off to some people the fact of having to use batteries when everything's charged these days but the benefit to having batteries is that if it runs out you can always pack a spare so you're using this for like the whole night you can pack like four batteries and you really don't have to worry about the light going off because you just swap out the batteries with the night core this is a usb rechargeable and it uses a micro usb so when this guy goes out it goes out as far as brightness goes the Nikkor um, advertises 85 lumens and the Coast advertises 80 lumens. So this one's supposed to be a little bit brighter. But um, let's just do a quick test and see if that's actually true. So you can see that the Nikkor is a little bit more of a focused light. And the Coast is a little bit more of a flood. And you can see in the Coast there's some yellow. Whereas this one is like white light. So, so this guy for sure is brighter. But for me... When it's dark and you blast something like this, it's, it actually kind of uh, irritates the eyes a little bit. So I like this more of a soft um, flood and I like it a little bit warm. Like that yellow, it makes it really easy on the eyes. At least for my use, you know, but if, I guess if you wanna, you wanna blind somebody, then uh, th this is your go-to right here. This is the red LED on the Nikkor. And this is the red LED on the Coast. So huge, huge difference. Let's say you have this in your bag, you pull it out, you can quickly clip it to your hat or something else. And this guy, there's no one-handed operation. You're really gonna have to like dig this into wherever you want it to go. And once you get in there, it's not going nowhere. But this guy, 
like it's just so much easier if you want the cooler looking flashlight this is your guy but uh i don't think you can go wrong with either of them especially given the price buy one of each uh play with it i mean it's it's so cheap buy two of each three of each whatever give it to your friends i think these are both really cool flashlights and uh yeah enjoy yeah.